Hello and welcome to FJS717 YouTube. The Courtyard. Chapter 1, Scene 4. One locked door. One ball and chain. One key. Which is chained. And a me. The Courtyard. Oh, does that ball and chain swing through the tree? No, but I, I fall if I go that way, I bet. Check for fall damage. Alright. The door's up there, but we also need the key. That ball's done swinging. Now, if I tap it, do I die? Yes. Okay. That one's kind of easy. Go down here. fall onto the ball though. The ball rolled off. We're good. We're good. Alright. One door down. The spiral. Two keys. Oh, two locks. Oh, I'm like right here. Spiral, spiral, spiral. Let's go this way. Wait, that didn't work. That's gonna put me where I was. Oh my gosh, the key's gonna fall out of nowhere. Oh, the key leaves, so two of my left marooned on this structure. <laughs> okay, start location. Spiral the keys in. Then do the keys just keep going in circles? That one's gonna slide down to me now. Okay, I like that. Okay, one. Okay, we're gonna try and fall without hitting the ground. I guess. No, that didn't do anything. We're on the ground. Oh wait, we're trying to fall onto that ground. Ah, no dice. Okay. And that... Does that get grabbed on that, maybe? We'll try and go slowly so we don't lose it. And check and see if it gets stopped by that one. No, it won't, because that would send it over there. Let's get that key back in its compartment. Oh my gosh, this is hell on, on my psyche. I see what I have to do. I have to catch it. Ah! Nice. The nook. <sighs> Okay, got our death ball right above us. Interesting. And if I tap it, do I die? What happens if we go this way? I like that D12 up there. The flower pot doesn't fall though. 
That ink looks cool dripping up hill like that. And then what? I'll catch myself over there. Ah! Wasted! To go past me. Do I make this fall here? Yes, nice. Chapter one, complete. I finally found someone who shares my passion for esoteric mathematics. We've agreed to begin work on some of my ideas. With his help, my dreams could be realized. What? All right, a door. His home. Ooh. The world is a much larger place when every wall is a floor. What, how am I supposed to get up there? Oh, okay, there's a hole in the floor. Everybody needs a hole in the floor. I'm glad I have a hole in my floor. Let's go two, not three. Chapter two. Episode one. The vortex. Oh, I gotta hit X. Rip a dip. Uh oh, what is that? It's gonna teleport me? Let's just try walking into it. Whoa, oh, if I stay in it, I get sucked down? What? Can I fall out of it? No, I do not think I can fall out of it. Oh, we could just go around the outside there. Oh, but then the key will fall in it. So we trap the key in here first. Ah! Oh, that'll bring the key to us, okay. I kind of want to see what the key looks like when it's in there. The precipice. Oh, so it comes and goes. Voila. Okay, good enough. The lion. We're at the lion. We can make the ball disappear. But if we drop down there, the vortex comes back and sucks us in, then the ball comes back and takes us out. So I don't know, let's try catching ourselves. Nope, not like that. Oh, well, here we go. We swing the ball all the way around and then it hits that and disengages it. Noise. Bammo. Nice. Pillars? The pillars? Pillars of doom? Or are they the pillars of death? Uh oh. I do not like the look of the pillars. Complete with key. <sighs> um, okay, yes, right. So the key can activate the disengage on that. No, maybe not. On that vortex. I think we're gonna wanna fall this way. And, oh, we can go down there. That's not the right way though, is it? Oh, this will put the key in the vortex though, which we don't want. That's how we get the key out once it's uh, locked in. 
Thank you for tuning in. Happy surfing.